A deadly spring break week so far here in Dallas, and it now has police stepping up their patrols to make sure that you are safe. Dallas police say 12 people have been killed in the city since Saturday. The latest violent crime happened just overnight, right outside of out, right outside of a popular bar in Deep Ellum. We know two people were shot and killed there, and our Olivia Leach is joining us now, updating us on the investigation and telling us how police plan to keep partygoers safe as we head into St. Patrick's Day weekend. Before we heard the shots. It was like boom, 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 boom. It was like, it was a lot. I couldn't even count them. A normal night out turned into tragedy at this popular bar in Deep Ellum. Dallas police responded to a shooting call here at the Bitter End Bar after 1 a.m. They say an unknown gunman walked up to a man standing on this patio and fired multiple shots at him, hitting the male victim and a woman standing behind the window inside. The two victims were taken to a hospital where they died. A third victim was hit but has non-life-threatening injuries. Bullet holes were still visible in the wall and the patio seats this afternoon. A crew was seen boarding up the windows and cleaning the scene. <laughs> Dallas police say the shooter is still on the run. After the shooting, the unknown gunman ran northbound on Elm Street. Homicide detectives are speaking to witnesses and working to identify and locate the suspect. And we're asking the public for assistance on this. Tourists I spoke to say they'll reconsider coming out here at night. Yeah, and then we heard like there's like great barbecue here. It's like a great like place to like look at art. Hearing that there's a shooting around, we feel like a little on edge being around here now because it looks so beautiful and like it's definitely up and coming, but it's a little scary knowing that there's shootings happening left and right. We asked Dallas Mayor Eric Johnson about the recent uptick in violent crime. In a statement, he says, while Dallas has been the only major American city to record two consecutive years of violent crime reduction in every major category, we understand that we still have work to do. Coming up tonight at 6, we'll explore DPD's recent addition, a special unit dedicated to patrolling Deep Ellum. Live in Deep Ellum, Olivia Leach, CBS 11 News. Olivia, thank you. We love our city. Let's protect it.